got your picture on my wall It reminds me that it's not so bad It's not so bad My tears gone cold, I'm wondering why Got out of bed at home The morning rain clouds up my window your picture on my wall it reminds me that it's not so bad it's not so bad Them, I wrote you, but you still ain't calling. I left my cell, my pager, and my home phone at the bottom. I sent two letters back in autumn. You must not have got them. There is probably a problem with the post office or something. Sometimes I scribble addresses too sloppy when I jot them. But anyway, what's been up, man? How's your daughter? My girlfriend's pregnant too. I'm about to be a father. If I have a daughter, guess who I'm a caller? I'm gonna name her Bonnie. I read about your uncle Ronnie too, I'm sorry. I had a friend kill himself or some bitch who didn't want him. I know you probably hear this every day, but I'm your biggest fan. I even got that underground shit that you did with Scam. I got a room full of your posters and your pictures, man. I like that shit you did with Rockus too, that shit was fat. Anyway, I hope you get this man, hit me back. Just a chat, truly yours, your biggest fan. This is Stan. My tea's gone cold, I'm wondering why I got out of bed at all. The morning rain clouds up my window. I can't see at all. Even if I could, it would all be gray. But your picture on my wall. Dear son, you still ain't called a row. I hope you have a chance. I ain't mad, I just think it's fucked up you don't answer fans. But if you didn't want to talk to me outside your concert, you didn't have to, but you could have signed an autograph from Matthew. That's my little brother, man. He's only six years old. He waited in the blistering cold for you for four hours and you just said no. That's pretty fucked up, man. You're like his fucking idol. He wants to be just like you, man. He likes you more than I do. I ain't mad, though. I just don't like being lied to. Remember when we met in Denver, you said if I write you, you would write back? And I'm just like you in a way. I never knew my father either. He used to always cheat on my mom and beat her. I can relate to what you're saying in your songs. So when I have a shitty day, I drift away and put them on. Cause I don't really got shit else, so that shit helps when I'm depressed. I even got a tattoo of your name across my chest. Sometimes I've even cut myself to see how much it bleeds. It's like adrenaline, the pain is such a sudden rush for me. See, everything you say is real and I respect you cause you tell it. My girlfriend's jealous cause I talk about you 24 seven. But she don't lo know you like I know you, Slim, no one does. She don't know what it was like for people like us growing up. You gotta call me, man. I'll be the biggest fan you ever lose. Sincerely yours, Stan, P.S. We should be together. Too. My tea's gone cold, I'm wondering why I got out of bed at all. The morning rain clouds up my window, I can't see at all. And even if I could, it would all be gray. But your picture on my wall, it reminds me that it's not so bad. It's not so bad. Dear mister, I'm too good to call or wrap my fans. This will be the last package I ever send your ass. 
It's been six months and still no word. I don't deserve it. I know you got my last two letters. I wrote the addresses on them perfect. So this is my cassette I'm sending you. I hope you hear it. I'm in the car right now. I'm doing 90 on the freeway. Hey, Slim, I drank a fifth of vodka. Dare me to drive? You know that song by Phil Collins in the air of the night about that guy who could have saved the other guy from drowning but didn't? But Phil saw it all then on the show he found him. That's kind of how this is. You could have rescued me from drowning. Now it's too late. I'm on a thousand downers. Now I'm drowsy. And all I wanted was a lousy letter or a call. I hope you know I ripped all your pictures off the wall. I love you, Slim. We could have been together. Think about it. You ruined it. Now I hope you can't sleep and you dream about it. And when you dream, I hope you can't sleep and you scream about it. I hope your consciousness eats at you and you can't breathe without me. See, Slim, shut up, bitch. I'm trying to talk. Hey, Slim, that's my girlfriend screaming in the trunk. But I didn't slit her throat. I just tied her up. See, I ain't like you. Because if she suffocates, she'll suffer more and then she'll die too. Well, I gotta go. I'm almost under the bridge now. Oh, shoot. I forgot. How am I supposed to send this shit out? Like tea's gone cold, I'm wondering why I got out of bed at all. The morning rain clouds up my window. I can't see at all. And even if I could, it would all be gray. But your picture on my wall, it reminds me that it's not so bad. It's not so bad. Dear Sam, I meant to write you sooner, but I've just been busy. You say your girlfriend's pregnant now. How far along is she? Look, I'm really flattered you would call your daughter that. And here's an autograph for your brother. I wrote it on the starter cap. I'm sorry I didn't see you at the show. I must have missed you. Don't think I did that shit intentionally just to diss you. But what's that shit you said about you like to cut your wrist too? I say that shit just clown a dog. Come on, how fucked up is you? You got some issues, Stan. I think you need some counseling to keep your ass from bouncing off the walls when you get down some. And what's about the shit meant us to be together? That type of shit will make me not want us to meet each other. I really think you and your girlfriend need each other. Or maybe you just need to treat it better. I hope you read this letter. I hope it reaches you in time. Before you hurt yourself, I think you'd be doing just fine. If you just relax a little, I'm glad I inspire you, Stan. But why are you so mad? Try to understand that I do want you as a fan. I just don't want you to do some crazy shit. I seen this one shit on the news a couple weeks ago that made me sick. Some dude was drunk, drove over his car over a bridge, and he had his girlfriend in the trunk. She was pregnant with his kid. All in the car, they found a tape. Didn't say who it was to. Come to think about it, his name. It was you. Damn. There, that's my last song of the night. And the phone's about to die, so that's... <laughs>